Hey, y'all, we're taking it to the old school. Sorry, we don't have the landscape today. I apologize for that, but uh, we are taking it to the old school. So we're doing this little, I know. But you know what? I didn't feel like setting up. I didn't feel like getting on my camera. I mean, my computer and then the chair and then the lighting. That's why it is very important. Why I said, I would I say decorating my life or designing my life, why I decorate. It's very important that that front room gets together for the studio because that's it. I want my living room to be my living room and I, I would be able to go in my studio right now. Everything would be set up and I would just be able to do the video. That's the what's I mean, like, that's what I want. I don't want to like here. Once I do my video, then I don't want this to feel like my work area, you know, so like designated work areas. They really working for me right now in my life. Like I need designated work areas. I want my living room to feel like a living room. So what I do, because, but I do love the bright wall. You know, I love the, the yellow wall and I love the lighting and I love the little chair that I sit in. So the other room has to be equally as pleasing. I have to feel like my, you know, my coloring is good, you know, which behind me is great. So I'm really designing that front room to be a studio. It's so important, especially you having interviews or, you know, people in the community, just, it would be great because it's a separation also from your personal space. I consider this living room, you know, my personal space. Or for the goddess, you know, special people. People, special people. There's a lot of special people. Special people will come through or who gets through. Or, But I would really first like to offer, and all people are special, I would really like to offer the, the front room again because we're talking about the front room right now. So you can tell. I would really like to have the front room be the receiving room. That's just, it's just that simple. I want the front room to be the receiving room. That's it. That's it. Very simple. Isn't that great one? And, but also in my case, that also means the studio. Cause I got interviews that I'm going to do with folks around the world. So we can do it virtually, of course, but interviews that I'm going to do with people, particularly like elders or just people in the community that, you know, are dope, you know, and I, I would love for them to, that should be the studio. That room never, because it's near the front door, it doesn't feel intimate no matter what you do and even kind of the draft, but it's great for a studio. Like my mind knows it's a studio, I can hook it up in a way that's still gonna be pleasant. And that's another thing I realized. So you see this beautiful dress, I'll, I'll show y'all another day. I should have really saved this dress and wore it, wore it for my Saturday get together, but you know, my Saturday talk at uh, Soul Good Vegan. But this dress is a who, what, where, I wore with leggings because it's kind of see-through, but it's still it's a heavy fabric. It has those puff sleeves, same as I bought a black jumpsuit from who, what, we. I guess that is that I'm going, I'm going to assume this is their going into spring maybe, but I don't know. But I mean, this is their style with the sleeves, and I just love, that was like in the 40 era. Like, I love the, the puff sleeves, and the color is vibrant. The color is amazing. The color is blessed. The color is blessed. So I really like that. Like, I love that. I love it. So, uh, but, you know, it did, I was standing, Janae took a picture of me standing in front of, in the blue room, in the blue room, blue wall, blue room, with this color. And I thought, oh, my gosh, the, the couch that I'm getting for the blue room is going to be this color. So that's good because I, I definitely pop with the blues, the yellows. I'm sorry. Well, the blues, too, but I mean, on me, the yellows, the golds, you know, y'all know. Like right now, I know my face is like beaming, right? Like I had a great, I, today, no, I mean, every day has been great. Like this is just in the line of greatness. But last night, y'all, oh my God, that pajama party was, it was, it was just myself, Goddess, and Janae. We got, we had our, uh, we did some candle magic. We did each other's feet and ways that, I mean, and paraffin and dipped it and then massaged. We did the foot thing that you know you put, you stick to the bottom of your feet and it pulls out all the toxins. I, I'm not lying. I felt the toxins leaving my body. That foot thing, I know some of you are familiar with it. That's a bomb thing. Like, I like to have that for once a month. Like, that's a bomb thing. I feel like I'm looking at my face. Like, what was that stuff? Like, what? Yes, yeah, so and she got that particular one from the store Dr. Aileen Bay and his beautiful wife. Uh, she got it from the base in Henderson, North Carolina. But I know you can get online, but whatever his stuff was, that stuff was incredible. Like, I was all in it. Like, 
I look at me. This is the I, I ain't put no extra nothing on. This is me all day. There's no extra shade. I don't even do that. I don't even put it on second time of day. What's going on? Like, oh, what is this glow? Like, what is that? Like, oh my God. So uh it was last night. Like I'm telling you, last night was last night was intergalactic. It was goddesses. It was it was what that girlfriend get away. I really hope we could do it. Oh God, please let us do it. I know we will one day. I understand what they're gonna be. I understand what what time with sisters spending time together. I now understand what that is gonna be from who I am, how I show up as a goddess. That was so lit. That was that was the way it was supposed to be. It was like I said, the feed, we massage, we did that, like I said, that the, the pull out the toxins. I, I I got things in me that I could feel like feel fixed. Like I'm just trying to tell you, like that was so I it was everything was perfect and then I made the live foods and they was loving the live foods so everybody that's watching me from the black and Roll food course I was loving the live food too like we know I was more a little more critical to my live food because I know how I make but I got I, I made this brownie I always make y'all check this lesson out it was a brownie I always make but I follow the recipe according to a woman that's actually on uh, YouTube so one of the raw vegan demos on YouTube, the white woman, and uh, I would go like the 15 days. Well, this one day, which was yesterday, I didn't have 15 days. Why 15? What was that about? But guess how many I had? I had 11 dates. 11 dates. I didn't have four tablespoons of cacao. I had three and a half at best. Okay, put that in there too. I put the 11 dates. I put the. the I had some salt. I had to have that and maca. I had the teaspoon of maca, and. I, I, and the mill and the almond mill, but usually I always go to almond mill more than that one cup. I was like under that one cup. Honey, that brownie yesterday was the best brownie I ever made. We could sell that brownie. That brownie was so damn good. It was creamy. It was, it was like a brownie has that texture that's spongy, but and it had a creamy, like almost like it was a chocolate topping. It wasn't a cacao topping, but it felt like it. So go off the goddamn recipe, okay? That's what I learned. So that cacao was, and I made a raw tuna. That raw tuna, you know what? I always got to remember with raw food. If you ever want to do it, you just want to know it's a little tip. I can eat a little, a little tip because, you know, when you do home shows, you got to talk about food. Um, you should always do, uh, um, well, I don't know what I'm going to say. But I was going to say raw foods is the absolute bomb, and it, it just cleans you up and clears you. Oh, when you make food like a, a pate, the tunas, any food, any raw food, other than a salad, other than a salad, I mean like the pâtés, the raw potato salads, what else could you make? Any of those things that got to go in the refrigerator, of course, because raw food does. When you first make it that day, it's, it's okay. But raw foods need time to marinate. So I would say wait till you have it tomorrow. It's like cooked foods in that way. The flavors marinate and they get better. When you first cook it, you don't have the same reaction. So you might not think you liked it or you, you was like, what's up with my food? And then the next day it cured a little bit. Cause like I had the tuna last night, I wasn't really feeling it. They loved it, of course. You know, we all critical of ourselves, but to know I had it today. Another thing, another rest, a secret I was thinking, raw foods pairs well with raw foods. Raw foods, I was all raw last night, but raw foods, because I I didn't have, the, the crackers took a long time. I made these flax crackers. I put tomatoes, fresh tomatoes in my garlic, the spices I got from this uh, chef in Chef April in Durham that I love her spices, uh, some spike. I, I'll be hooking it up, you know. And, uh, but they take a long time, so 12 hours, sometimes 14, especially if you're keeping them under 120 degrees then you really because you don't want to cook them you just want to pull out the water basically to dehydrate okay but you want to maintain those nutrients and so today i had the the, the, the um tuna raw tuna this is like all plant-based raw vegan uh and it, with now because my crackers are, are done oh my god those two paired so well together the taste was fantastic it's like having a pate at your you know at your girls get to get together or a dip, but it's raw, and the crackers feels like something you would pay more on a Whole Foods, or because they seem more like exotic in a sense. And I don't mean even exotic of dark people. Just it's a wonderful taste. So for those that are like transitioning, but you still want to have your dinner parties, or have your girlfriend getaways, or your girlfriend nights out, or in 
then you can do raw nicely. Like I will show you, like I would, I, my tuna was no nice. I either shape it into cheese and put it on a cheese board, you either slice it. My brownies was so nice. My brownies was so nice. Like, and I forgot, like God is like, I'm a, yeah, I'm gonna start cutting them. God is some, you know, she just did it like cut them already so you can see and then you can just pick up the squares. I know you're thinking like, what, 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 what happened? It was the bomb. We was we called up Oshun. Oshun, this is like her color. The hair was green, same goddess, different time or maybe different place because everything is happening at the same place at the same time. That's called quantum, and that's what I'm living off. Quantum reality, quantum physics. So, uh, but anyway, uh, we called up Oshun. This is that too. This is Oshun. Like Oshun came, and she is the goddess of beauty, and she came, and that was it. And then I went on my date, and it was very nice. It was a nice day. It was a very nice man, you know, polite, everything. It was, it was, everything was a good day. It was a great day. I'm flying on a high-flying disc, so I'm not surprised. It's like, but the but real, the real thing, though, the real, like, it was, the, it was our ritual. It was us being together in that way. It's just everything flowed. We went from upstairs, and we went downstairs, and it was like all these spiritual things was happening. We was all getting these instant answers and it was we gonna do it every once a month our girl time together spent in that way because we didn't get to do our facials god has had it god has massaging feet facials paraffin it was like what is this for real live food everybody was doing so everybody contributed it was beautiful Janae brought the fruit god has had the sparkling drinks and uh you know of course, non alcoholic, and I brought the live food, and then we got the candles, and it was dope. It was dope. It was dope. You would have loved it. You would have loved it. So, yeah, so raw food. So, anyway, it was a hit. Like, you know, like it's be nice to set up, like how to set up an evening for your girls, you know, when you're on that kind of like intergalactic ish, you know, when you're on like a more spiritual ish. Like, we, I want to do, I'm going to do a video like that because I'm going to do, maybe I'm going to do it tomorrow. Where you know how to set up your space for your girls, cause they always got girls in night in, right? But it's always the bar cart. Maybe it's not what I think a lot of y'all might want to see, cause I was thinking about this table. I really did put that table there for an enter as an entertainment table, and I think it still can be, you know. So I it's a kind of like a buffet, you know, but an entertainment table where you could serve from or at least have the food out. So I'm cause I think we should. I think we should like maybe host them in different houses at different times. I think that would be nice as well. So yeah, that's what I'm thinking. And y'all, I'm really, after I get this downstairs together, I'm then gonna work on, I'm gonna work on upstairs. Upstairs, listen, I'm running away from it and I don't need to do it. It needs to be a guest room. It needs to be a guest room. And I would like it to be. I mean, my funky, my way, still a beauty room, all that, but it needs to be a funk, not where they have to lay on the floor, because most people can't do that. So, yeah, so, yeah, so I'm, I'm, you know, I'm good. Like, oh, yeah, just a wonderful weekend. That God is time. If you got some good girlfriends, treat them well. And all of that, I'm high flying. I'm high flying. So, and this gorgeous hairstyle, like this hairstyle right here. Oh my God, I want to talk about beauty, Afrocentric decor, decorations. Like my girl, so I, I just, I want to just show you her choice of beads. Just absolutely stunning. And then this here, and then it's like a design, it's like almost like a shell. The, the design of it is just so stunning. It's very, very beautiful. I really, really love it. But, you know, like I tell y'all, I'm going to take better care of my hair because this is what I like. Like, I'm a, you know, I'm a, yeah, sister, but I'm a, I'm a brand too. I mean, just that simply. And I think brands, there's nothing wrong with a brand. A brand comes from people being authentic and somebody decides to brand it, to be honest. And it's really your personality. It's who you are. It's who, like, you want to be represented or how you want to be represented. But it's all, but it's, it's connected to who you feel most like, what you, who you feel most comfortable with or in or wearing or doing. It's your stamp. It's your story, you know? And this, the braids, this way, it just, I just feel so connected to my past, you know, the continent, my ancestors. It's just, it, it's something more, like, and the way, like, you can really see, like, she designed it. And those symbols in the hair, 
They're very, um, they're very high vibing. Like they're very uh, cosmic. They're 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 giving sending messages. It's like cornrows have always done in our culture. They're sending messages. And Shalisha Webb, like my goddess's daughter, like if you could, I don't know if you stayed as long, but. She is a designer, and I usually go to her and say, do what you do. I want an idea. I, I, maybe I want all the hair to the side, but she designs it She, because I let her go. And I just respect that. Like so many designers out there, it's not just, you know, how to move the couch around and put the right pillows. Hair designers, and she is a designer. She sits, she's looking at the bees, and she's lining them the way she, her, her mind sees it. It's really, really dope. And then I got it paired with, now these earrings, I love these earrings. These earrings here, they're crystal, but I think they're mother of pearl and, mother of pearl and um, moonstones. That's what I think. I'm, I'm almost sure. So they're just very, they, I feel very balanced and they're very dainty. They go with this beautiful piece. It was made by Ramona or Ramona, I think it's Ramona or Ramona. I forget her last name, but she's a beautiful Haitian sister. See her on YouTube, I mean, on Facebook. But anyway, she, I brought out like the heavy duty. So we had a great time. It was fabulous. And then my friend, he brought me all the way from South Carolina. He, I got me some burdock root. I got to remember which ones are which. Sarsaparilla. Let me see elderberries, elderberries. Let me see if I'm doing this right. This is eye bright, eye bright. Okay, this is this is the dandelion. Either this is the dandelion or that other root one, but I think this is the dandelion, and this is the pars alfalfa. This is the alfalfa, or is it parsley? No, it's the alfalfa. This is the alfalfa. Oh my god, because he taught me the herbs, and I wanted to remember because they're not labeled, and then I took pictures of them. I did a video, so I remember, but I, I, just, I didn't look at the video. Y'all noticed that. So when herbs come to me, especially somebody who will come that far, they're for me. Like, it's my, it's the universe calling. Herbs, my, my, I'm, I did a black raw vegan course, because I've been raw vegan for a very long time. Uh, off and on, but straight for six years, for sure. And, um, and, uh, and. Herbs are everything. Like, herbs are part of it. So anyway, I did a class, and I told them I'm going to start next week. We're going to start the next step, which is now connecting the raw foods basically with spirituality. And what I believe that raw foods, is, it, it connects you to, it opens you up where you can hear and feel things in a very, very different way. It's really wonderful. It's really wonderful. So when herbs come to you, they're for you, the person was very knowledgeable the brothers like he know his stuff i'm very just very proud of him in general just a good person and when people bring it to you it's like it's spiritual it's for you it's like the goddess you could say brought it or your ancestors brought it but they're alive and they need to be taken seriously and uh these are definitely like high level and then he brought me i see this other stuff this beautiful it's a cream it's called batana 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 from Honduras, which I say Honduras, but Honduras, and it is an oil, a cream. It is so dope. Hold on. It's, it's dope. So it comes in a bigger package. They put some in a jar, but it's strong. It's strong. It has a, some people say coffee smell. Some people say chocolate smell. I don't smell either one of them. I smell what it smells like, and I love it. I'm getting that stuff. It's like Kendra Shaw's products. It's that stuff from the root, from the earth. Like that keeps. Look at this. I mean, I'm getting the 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 root. You know, uh, the roots of a lot of the herbs. So that's coming to me. And the other thing he gave me was the uh, chlorella, which is not to be confused with the spirulina because they look alike. But chlorella is supposed to be the dopa. Uh, you know, the more powerful in a sense, or for what you need. So I put that in the refrigerator, as he told me. And this right here, your hands. Instantly are nice and shiny when you use it. It penetrates really, really well. But the best part, it makes your hands instantly soft. Like this would be something I would want to carry around. But I want to like shave it. I'm sure after a while, if you leave it in the car, at least it would melt. But not probably on your purse. Because this is it in a very warm environment. So imagine when it's colder. Like this is that hand lotion stuff. Like this was great. Batana. Batana. B-A-T-A-N-A. From Honduras, and uh, yeah, so he ordered it. And he, 
So yeah, I got my gifts. I got my gifts. It was wonderful. So what I'm going to do is tonight, because everything is so wonderful. I took my own shoe bath. What I'm going to do tonight is... Uh, because uh, I took a bath, I took an ocean bath for tonight. Yeah, I'm going to make the herbs. I'm going to make the, the right ones. And this combination right here is supposed to be like the dope combination. It's basically cleaning everything. So I keep attracting herbalists because that tell me that, yeah, I, I know the herbs is what they're calling me. And herbs will call you. It's like my time to learn it, to have knowledge, and to team up with other people who actually have it as well. Like that's a service that I'm going to have to consistently be able to offer to my clients because I was really thinking of this. This is some, I'm raw right now because the herbs cleanse me enough to make me lose that palate for, in my case, cook food. For yours, it could be some other food that you really know it's not good for you. You don't want it, but you can't quite get away from the addiction of it because that's all it is. It's an addiction. Them herbs... Them herbs, they they clear and cleanse, and whether it's the thing on the feet, I'm sure that's some herbs in there, or you know the food, the foods you eat, you know your, but the herbs, the herbs, and these herbs are from South Carolina. Some of them, yes, South Carolina, some of them, and South Carolina has a lot of herbs. I remember I was gonna go to the herbal symposium conference for a day, but I still got the information. Nothing is lost. When the ancestors want to get you something, they're going to get it to you in one way or another. That's why I'm taking the herbs very seriously. Because the person who delivered to me was very spiritual. So I know that. So I know that this like herbs is like, yes, you want to go into the next atmosphere. He was just talking about herbs that when you sleep, you you uh, you uh feel good. You sleep well. I remember when I took the third phase of the full body detox. So the same similar herbs to this because they're both definitely Dr. Sabi inspired. I would say that. And... uh and that was the one where sleep was like amazing. Like you slept well, you couldn't wait. It felt, you didn't feel groggy when you got up, but the, the sleep was great. And he was talking about the herbs is that like a, the best way to take them, he said, is at night as opposed to in the morning because they get in your system, you get that nice sleep. Because a lot of them are very relaxing. So anyway, I'm about to get my herbs on. I'm going to choose, I'm going to choose which ones I'm going to mess with and, uh, uh, together and I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. So I'm lucky. And I'll do the, I'll take the chlorella. I'll put it in my water. And now when I drink my water, I'll put the chlorella in at least for tomorrow. So yeah. So I'm not going further away from raw. Uh, I'm going higher. I'm going closer like to that, just that clean life, you know, that clean life. So not perfect, no perfect, you know, just clean as possible and wherever you need to be. So I'm excited. I'm excited. So it was dreamy. It was a very beautiful, magical weekend. Very beautiful, magical week. You know, it's all good. Like we are so filled with this love that's that's as bright and as and as and as beaming and as I don't know how to say shiny in a sense the glowiness of this shirt or this dress that I have on. Like that's what love is. And we all have it. Nobody else has it. Nobody else makes us have it. Maybe they, somebody else could ignite it, but you could ignite it with your own self. It is everything. It is everything. So I realized that and I love that. It's within. And you, so it's all good. That's where I am. I'm in love. It's within. And everywhere I go, there's love. And I, I, I give thanks for that. So where are we? Hey, Lakeisha. Hey, she love, loving the sunshine. Yo, thank you. I'm, I got to show you one day, y'all. It is dope. It is so dope. It's like, wow. I really picked the dress out. Like, I love it. Right? So, yeah, thank you, Queen Lex. Queen Lex. Queen Lex. Leper. Thelma, greetings, Queen. Loving the hair and the whole look. Yes, thank you. Lisa Marie, your hair charms are nice. Thank you, Sheila. Nice. Thank you. Queen says, ooh, what's the foot thing? Oh, that's right. Remember the foot rings that I got, too. It was wonderful. I'll share it one day. Maybe my course. It was very so great. Uh, okay. Uh, yes, yes. P hey, DJ. Peace and blessings of Marie. Well, how it was wonderful. Like I was saying, it was wonderful. I mean, it was wonderful. You know, it was nice. It was good. So hold on, I go to it. It was wonderful. Uh, thank you. Hey, Eat Gypsy. Why you look amazing? Thank you, Boy Roll Cr. Thank you. But make sure to like the video. Thank you. You look ready. So thank you. Yes, honey. I'm. 
this is like that Oshun thing. Like it was last night. Like I, I saw. I mean, because that was like the really. It was boom. It was wonderful. But today was wonderful too. Today was wonderful too. Like, let me tell you what I learned today. Like, I am a. Uh, I'm here to do great works, and I'm doing it. And I, I don't know. I just loved myself more, and I don't know. Like, that's what we should have interaction with people that make us all bright up and and love ourselves even more. Cause we are so much to love. We're such a light, shiny beings. Like, it was good. Everything's good. Like, I don't anticipate my life not being good and that all encounters are blessed and beautiful and sunny and shiny and you know because like i keep saying like what i realized i think what i realized today again which i mean i don't even realize it's not realize what i keep saying because i know i'm on the highest vibrational frequency but the love is not a love that somebody is giving or taking or whatever it's not anybody else it's my love and i love that so much like i love that I'm in a, a vibration of love. So yes, people come with beautiful gifts or come to sheer knowledge or wisdom. Like I can see, like, I don't think that I'm gonna be living here for long. I don't, I just feel like it's gonna be time to move to something more receiving. Like I'm more social. So yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna be out there like doing things and even in my space more and having people in the community and, and the gatherings and having conversation and, just meeting high vibe people, such a blessing. And so it was that it was on the realm of another high vibe person. And he felt like Ken. He felt like Ken. I think we looked alike. The waitress thought we were related. She thought like it was like my Ken walking through the door. He looks like my cousin, I'm sorry, my uncle Snooky, who was actually born in North Carolina, but he was, I guess, Ken, of course, raised in New York like my mother's children, my mother's siblings. That's who he was. He looks a lot like him. So it's that like ancestral thing, you know, or that just the information was powerful. I don't know what nothing is about nothing. I say yes to it all. I allow it to come through and I let it be. Yeah, I don't have that thing that is somebody else or somebody's going to bring something to me that I don't already have. I'm ridiculously in love with myself and it feels so good. And then the Oshun ritual yesterday, I'm just at ease with myself, my divine femininity, my beauty. Like I'm at ease, I'm at ease as a woman, I'm at ease as a spirit, like I'm just so at ease. It's just, this is this is a powerful time. And I hope y'all feeling this 2020, I hope you're taking advantage of it. I hope you're using it to create those perfect visions because they're all perfect visions. That's the true discovery. When you feel, you figure that out, it's now life is a ball. So yeah, I receive it all. I get everything that I need when I need it. And I, and, and I love that all of the time, all of the time. And so do you. But yes, the God is Oshun, like that's the, I am a, a I mean, somebody asked you, uh, oh, it's a great question. It was just a class question, it just came to me, but I am the goddess in the flesh. Every damn th thing you do down to when I got the nails done, Oshun was already in the house. She came through the, 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 the yellow wall. The orange glow is the name, but she came through that wall and she never left. She comes through the dress. She wanted me to get my nails done. She wanted me to get my uh, toes you know, done and manicured. Then I got more of the feet. She wants me to take herbs and have beautiful hairstyles that represent my culture and the culture of ancient African beauty. Blackberry beauty, yes. This is like it is about the ancient beauty, the beauty from the foods that we eat and the thoughts that we think and the people that we're around. Like that's me, and I could feel the shift. I could feel the upward m mobility. I could feel the upward movement. Like I could feel like I'm I'm on something else and I'm riding something else. Like it's nothing feels the same, look the same, tastes the same, touch. I got a whole life, and it ain't even over. It's about to, what they say, fancy your, fasten your seatbelts. It's about to be a bump. And that ain't going to be bumpy. It's going to be a magic carpet ride. And y'all should come along because it's going to be fun. And hopefully you can create some magic carpets of your own because that's what I want for y'all. It's all good. It was great. It was nothing offensive. It was like he was very polite, very loving, very respectful, uh, admired me, you know, watched me for a long time too, and... 
just a good person, just a good human being and shared some amazing information with me. This is a beautiful time in our lives and everybody got something for you, but guess what? You got something for everybody. Life is an exchange. But I, when you ask me like the whole thing, like I just feel like my awareness is that I'm, that last night, that goddess thing was so, like I called Janae and said, are you feeling? She's like, I know, I feel it too. And I talked to God, I wanted to say, God, she, we both was being, all of us was beaming. We look all 10 years younger. It's a little sleepy because, you know, it's been a, a whirlwind of a week. Like, it's been a beautiful week. It's just been, I got to create my vessels. That's why I got the next intensive coming, so I can create my vessels. Because my cup runneth over. Like, my cup runneth over. There's no doubt. Like, I just got to get ready for all this, and I want to help you do the same. So next, I got a couple of things. Next Sunday, I'm doing a two-hour workshop, and that two-hour workshop is on blacks and meditation and really showing you how to meditate in a way that you could actually do, and it will take you out of here and start manifesting those blessings. That's on Sunday. I don't know what time yet, but you can buy it, but, you know, it'll. You, I got you. And then that, next Sunday, I also start my second part of the Raw Food course, but you can come in still like the first now we're connecting the raw foods to, in a sense, spirituality. I, I got a title for it, but I just don't remember the title now. But it's still that connection between that and spirituality. So we're going to the next level. We're going to the, the yeah, the, the, the oh, yeah, it's going to be dope. It's going to be dope. So we're going to that. That's next Sunday as well. But that's only for like 40 or 45 minutes. And then uh, the first Sunday in February... We're going to start the 21 day intensive. That's that is the creating oh my cup runneth over, creating uh, vessels for abundance and prosperity. And it's about just this. It's coming from everywhere. See, like yo, we goddesses, and when you're a goddess, like of course they're gonna love you and they're gonna treat you with love and they're gonna love, like be careful. They're gonna love you so much. Like I mean, like be careful not in a bad way, but like what I learned through my whole day today because Oshun brought this is that. A woman that's in touch with something deeper, her her divine femininity, whether that's getting in touch with the God is calling her up or doing certain rituals or eating certain foods, you will never have to worry about anything. Like you, you will always get what you know, need, deserve, desire. You're a goddess, like you're a queen, like it's deeper like we think. And I would say men are not stupid, men are... They respond. They we're the leaders, and they will act accordingly, meaning in a good way. So it's not putting pressure on you, but because it's not pressure, it's natural for you. You're you're a woman, and you're you're soft, and you're sensual, and that doesn't have to lead to sexual. And real men know that. You know you're worth driving for, or bringing herbs, or flowers, or information, or whatever. You know so. It's a, yeah, you just got to learn how to receive, but that's, that's, so that's like, both those courses are going to talk about that, but the uh, raw food, I'm, that's what I'm getting more into the raw food is the whole idea of this. What is this really all about? Why raw foods? It's just going to make your skin glow. It's so much deeper. It's so much deeper. So, yeah. So anyway, but thank you, uh, thank you. Yes, please thumbs up, ladies, and like the video, share, comment, and subscribe. Uh, Latricia, hey, good evening to you. Lakeisha, okay, Latricia, okay. Such a beautiful thing to fall in love with self. Yes, Alafi, I love you here. Thank you, Uniquely Beautiful. It's the, I've never been here. It's the, I have never, ever been here. I've said the lip service, everybody else say, I wanted to love myself when people say, yes, all you got to do. That was, you know, if people give you advice about that, it's the key to life. I didn't know what that meant. So, yeah, it's nice. You nice with everybody. Like, it's cool. People do, but you love yourself. So, you know, but definitely receiving, though, too. You got to receive. Everything that comes, you know, you give thanks, you know. It's just beautiful. It's beautiful. Like, I feel like I finally learned how to date. I didn't before. I was, I would know, because we don't really know yourself. That, that's another thing. Like, that if you don't know your own power, somebody knows it more than you, that's never a good thing. It's just not. It's backwards. It's, you going to have a backward relationship. Believe me, I had a lot of them to know. But when you are high-vibing and you know it, everybody that's attracted to it know it too, and then they are high-vibing too, like that's when you 
you almost don't need you. You want the relationship is nice. I want one. I do. I, I'm I'm definitely ready for second relationship. I'm ready for it. Like I'm I want it. I'm ready for it. I don't know if this is it or not because I am not rushing. I'm not rushing. No rushing. That's the opposite of that's not that's 2019 and you know what I'm saying. That that's not that's not 2020. That's just not it. And you know the brother understands that that you know hey show me yeah, that's nice. That sounds good. I believe it all. You know, hey, you know, this is what it takes. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's not easy. He knows, you know. I'm a sacred woman, so I ain't, I ain't doing what I used to do, y'all. I don't. It's not necessary. I don't want to. It's that I'm a goddess, and I know it. So it's kind of, it's like dope. So yeah, I never been here. So I, you know, it's good. Yeah, it was cool. It was great. It was a great day. It was a, it was a, it was a, it was a goddess day. It was very like we were floating, all of us on night ether because the goddess is alive and magic is afoot, y'all. The goddess is alive and magic is afoot. So, so, yeah, but I learned a lot about myself through other people and y you don't always, you look with yourself, so you just don't know, but hanging out with goddess and Jernay, it showed me, I don't know, goddess blessed me today. She got real close and told me, she was like, you know, she just told me some beautiful stuff about where she saw me and about my incredible wisdom and ability to move people. And my friend, my date told me the same thing in his own way, the ability to move. And uh, so I'm ready to step into who I am, who I am. I'm ready, I'm ready. So a lot of blessings. So it was a beautiful, amazing week because I'm trying, this was the ending of a beautiful week. It, that's why now we're all like kind of a little bit exhausted, but in the best way, we're all just dreamy exhausted. I'm the last one up. I'm sure Janae was going to the gym so she wouldn't go to sleep, but she's going to sleep and Goddess is already sleeping. So I guess it's my turn. And my friend has got three hours to go drive home. So, so yeah. So yes, it's, it was great. Yeah, I was really, everything is really good and it starts right here, right now. So, but that Goddess energy, Oshun is my Goddess. I know it. Because I, 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 the class I took that I gave on the last channel, don't worry, we're going to, so let me just say, we are going to have more Oshun courses, more of the real beauty, more of the, you know, how I date now. Like, I'll do a video on that. Like, how I'm dating now. It don't matter how old you get. When you are sacred, you are sacred. And all of y'all is sacred. So, you know, men want to step up to the plate. And they want to show you what they can do. And since you got so much love for yourself, you're loving yourself, and your high vibe wasn't nobody else. Nobody else gave you the high vibe. Nobody else brought it to you. You already had it. You ain't in no rush. You're not desperate. You're like, okay, okay. And that's that's dope. Like, I'm, I'm in a dope place right now, so I'm good. Everything is beautiful. It's beautiful. Nothing, but like I said, I very peace and love. It was very nice. Very nice. I had a good time. I expect to always have that. So so that's that, y'all. Okay, so okay. Oh, you do oh I love that. I'm not gonna go. Good evening. Hey Deborah. Unique says, I love hearing these beautiful things. Oh, I'm so glad. That's so wonderful. That vibe is good, huh? Like the video, ladies. Thank you, Gypsy. Antoinette says your skin is radiant. Thank you. I love that. Say I am ridiculously, yes, in love with me, something I'm learning. Thanks for that. You are welcome. And Antoinette, I've been seeing your Facebooks. You look like another person. You look beautiful. Like I saw you, I said, oh, my God, you're doing the work. And so don't believe me. Wherever you want to get to, you're going to get there. That Oshun course was so, that Oshun course was so nice. And then I had an Oshun experience. If y'all ever could, though, join me. You want to join me on one of them girlfriend getaways. Them weekend classes, that's me. I can't do big, large classes, not in person, because it has to be intimate. That that I'm very clear on. I need to, I mean, I'll do I can do speaking engagements, I can fill up a room. That for sure. Cause I love that. And people need it and I need it too. But I like the scheduling with the women. We are we we are I now know too, like when you when you riding on that wave or just on that. You feel in spiritual, and let's say, in a different way. Um, your courses can't even be advertised like everybody else's because 
you got to understand certain people, only the right people or the people that can hear the message is coming. Don't worry about the numbers because some of your other ones are entrepreneurs out there, your healers. It's not the numbers you, if anybody there that was off yesterday would have threw off the whole three of us. It's just, it was supposed to be that. And you'll always will find the people that's supposed to come to you. Don't look at numbers. That's what the social media got us on, looking at numbers or likes or comments or subscriptions. Don't look at the numbers because that's not it. It's not it. It's the delivery of the message. And the ones that come notice that these are the three that showed up. I feel like all the stuff that I've done on a spiritual level, finally at my age, just saying it boldly, it's been a lot. So I learned a lot. I learned a lot about myself. I learned a lot about others. But mostly I learned a lot about myself. I didn't need to know about everybody else. I didn't know about me. And when you learn yourself, now you know everybody else. That's why you can have more love, more compassion, more human kindness, because you know yourself, so you know everybody. You know, so because really we're all one, and they, everybody experienced something, so you're more gentler. And I think that's why the brother being a Leo, um, I think that when Leo's, when your same sign shows up, that definitely means that you've been doing a significant amount of work on yourself, and you, you have been loving yourself. That's why I showed up right there in front of you. So I learned that again. So, but also Leos always make me, I'm partial to Leos because I understand them. It's like your twin nobody gets or your, somebody that share your sign, you just more partial to them or you're at least more patient or whatever you call it because you know them. It's just an understanding. So when Leo show up in my life, it's like, it, it helps me to yield and to listen and to be there more since that's my Nobody might not get them, but I do because, you know, you got that both that weird thing or that. Whatever, that, that trait. of and Every sign has traits in them. The liking, and you see that, it's cool. So every time I see Leo coming, I'll be like, okay, you're doing a significant amount of work with yourself, and you loving yourself. I know it. I know it's same signs. I really like that. People think it might not be you stay together. You might not even get together, you know. You might not, like I've been just saying that, like, but every connection is divine and all of it don't have to lead to sleeping with the man or looking for the forever in it. Just like, just, we need to chill out is what we need to do when we date. And I like this little chill out thing. It's not like you don't have a whole life and other things are going on. So I love it. Like this is the courting or slow dating or, you know, being friends first, like friends is valuable. This is kind of stuff we were talking about at the, I'm going to call it the goddess circle for now, the goddess pajama party. Um, yeah, it's like, I, 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 this is my experience, ladies. For those that keep the late show, this is the late show, so you're going to get it. Tomorrow's a holiday, okay? Best holiday in the world, Dr. Martin Luther King's Day. Uh, of all the things that I've done, so I know I'm talking from experience. I'm, this, is, this is auntie for those that are younger. And for those that look at a younger face, this is granny. This advice not for me, but I know I, I take it. I wouldn't advise having sex quickly with anybody. I think a man should court you for a whole year if they really in it. If they could do a whole year and not get any and be consistent, you know what kind of man you would have? You know what kind of man you would like? You know, what kind of you and that man would work there with no matter what age? So... I personally think I I think you can build deep friendships, and those are the ones that's gonna when, it rela when that's gonna make the relationship last. It's the ones that's built on. I'm talking about deep friendships, and you ruin that when you have sex too fast. I'm talking from experience. I'm talking from spirit. <laughs> I'm talking from auntie, granny, and your the rest of them, your sister. Don't do that. Don't unless unless you do it. Because let me just say it. Everybody has a path, and it's one. It's good. It's good for them, and nobody can. It's everything is cosmic, and everything is cosmic in a great way. Like that's whatever. You, but I'm telling you that some telling me to tell y'all this, and I just keep feeling this for myself. If that has that really been working for you, like the giving up too soon, because that to me sometimes is a sign. Because I've had low self esteem, like I know it. I'm kind of like low self esteem, like you still don't think you're good enough that you could just say. No, not, not not now, or not yet, or not about that, or no, or just let them know, like, hey, I'm a sacred woman, like, I'm a special woman, like, to anybody. So, and to, when you meet a man that could do it, then you got to keep her. It's not like they got to jump through hoops, but there was, like, rites of passages in all cultures to, to show you how manly you are to get the, 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 the best woman. 
or the best peacock, like whatever, <laughs> whatever, you know, animal kingdom, so-called human kingdom is all the same, really it is. So I just feel like that's what Oshun teaches me is like, yeah, okay, that's nice. So, you know, like, you know, and, and then somebody say, okay, yeah, I, I'm, yo, I'm here to show and prove. Like, okay, cool, cool, absolutely cool. Be friends, form friendships with men and the ones that were supposed to stay, they will, they will come see you. They will wait that time. They will be respectful. You know, they will. They will. We, we lead, but we forget. We totally forget. So just so you know, like, I know I'm not about that life anymore, like the sleeping with somebody or like the super falling in love, like right the same day. Like, is that, that's not real. And who, I wouldn't want to be another person with somebody that fall in love with everybody, like man or woman. That's not cute. You know, I think a man should earn a woman's love. Like, your love is, because that love, we talk about something you feel like you give to somebody that's special to you, not just the sex I'm talking about. So you ain't got to fall in love overnight. Like, I mean, you might, it's okay, but, you know, really, love is grown. You, like, grow into love. Like, love is, is cultivated, you know. Love is, uh, it's already here, because you and that love like that, you already have it. So I believe a man should court. Courting is a very beautiful, sensual act. I'm all about the courting. Step to the plate. If you know, if you, but I, I wouldn't, a year, you get to know them every season. And you like get to know their character because are they really going to keep up now? You know what I'm saying? Are they really going to keep doing this? Are they really in it to win it? And you, and definitely they're going to be at the end. If they don't make it, they sure going to be a better man. So you was responsible for that without stressing yourself out. So that's my thing. Like, I got that message on show. I got that in general. I've been getting that lately. Sex is sacred, period. Women can't handle no casual sex. And the one that can, congratulations. That's, you got a skill. Most women I know, we deal from the heart. And we can't have casual sex. That don't work for us, most of us. We connect quickly. Because that's a very powerful entity is the canal, you know, the yoni, but the canal, like what runs through the canal? We want some good water, good energy running through the canal. So like, you don't, mm -mm, nah, you don't, have to, and at my age, like I know that. So it's even better. It's like, oh, oh, wait, wait. I'm, and then like, when you know who you are, you like, you don't, it's a pleasure to be up on this. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Like, you better know, like, you better know, like, you are the goddess, cause the, the queen, you know, princess from some of y'all youngsters. And so, no, I, I am, um, I'm like, yeah, show and prove, you know, show and prove. I'm still from Brooklyn, y'all. I'm still from Brooklyn. So that is the dealio. It was, it's all good in the hood. It's all good. So, yes, let's see. But thank you, Antoinette. That was nice, right? Uh, what's the name of the ocean course? I let me see. It's called Blackberry Beauty Secrets. Believe it or not, Blackberry Beauty Secrets. I'm almost positive it's called that. Antoinette says thanks. Learning from the best. Oh, I love you for that. Uh, all the ocean course was in person. No, it was virtual. It was just recorded now. It, it was a class virtual. It wasn't in person. Yeah, sex is very sacred. Yes, yes. That's just me. For those that believe something else. Go for it. But as a woman that's 52, if you maybe you're not 52, and if you are 52, some of y'all know about this too, um, you're still as sacred as a youngster. I mean, maybe, yeah, if somebody want to make babies, okay, they're not going to be attracted to you because you're not probably making babies no more. That's okay. Like, that don't mean you're not a queen. That don't mean you're not, you don't need to be courted. Like, I, you know, like now, I don't know why. You can't leave, believe in a society that tells you, like, you all, oh, like, who got lots of people. Lots of people, like a queen is a valuable woman. That's why she a queen. She valuable, you know what I'm saying? We say queen, what's up, queen, what's up, queen? But we better start thinking about that because queen is a valuable woman. So, I, uh, yeah, yeah, oh, soon, y'all. I need some drink of water or something. But anyway, I'll get in in a minute. But I'm not going to keep y'all. It was a great, it was a beautiful night, beautiful day, beautiful everything respect to the brother because i know he's gonna be watching this and respect to his uh his hospitality southern hospitality and knowledge and wisdom we got some dynamic 
brilliant brothers on that food tip and that herb tip. You know what? I I didn't study Dr. Savi enough, but the protégés that he has left will make him very, very proud. He, We got some brilliant brothers in these herbs, and that's what I want Blackberry Beauty and Lisa Marie, and Lisa Marie Goods and all of them. I want them to be showing men and women. That's why I like my show on Friday. I'm gonna have men from the community as well. We are a community. And like I said, Gil Noble like it is. I told y'all, he had everybody, men and women, all the genres, the whole bit. But we are a, a dope community, and that'd be great to see black men doing all these positive and amazing things, owning their own businesses, uh, into the herbs and veganism, bringing health and wellness to the brother wants to bring health and wellness to this community in South Carolina. They dying at early ages. He got three olds with full out diabetes, and the stories he was telling was almost you would think it's unbelievable, unbelievable. And they, they study in the food, they understand it. Like, I cannot wait to have some of these brothers on here to tell y'all this knowledge. And it's gonna, it's gonna, it's very, we're, we're, we're amazing people. So I get to learn, like, I just be like, wow. Like, I got some knowledge today, wisdom today, like yesterday, today. So it was good, y'all. It's, it's right in the high vibe. Everything, right? But like I said, I'm going to get these herbs on. So when I be going through the atmosphere, you know, when I levitate, because you know it's coming. I've been telling you about this levitation thing. Uh, I think it's coming. I think I've levitated metaphorically already. So maybe that's the extent, but we don't know because, you know, it could happen. It's going to happen. Uh, so, yeah, so I'm going to, I know these herbs are going to be powerful, and I'm just so thankful for that. I'm so thankful, and I'm thankful for y'all. All right, y'all, love y'all very much. Um, I'm sorry, I know, like, Live Free TV was like, you were Afrocentric home to court, but y'all got the bonus. You know what? I don't know if it was Queen Lex or, no, I think it was, it was, uh, yeah, Queen Lex, I think it was you, but, and I was on this channel, and I was all getting all spiritual and hippie, and I said, oh, I'm being so hippie. You was like, no, you, we, you know, or something like, you know who your audience is, or your audience know who you are. And I'm so glad you said that because I want to, this was originally going to be called this channel Afrocentric Spiritual Home Decor. That's exactly, and I took the spiritual out. But I am spiritual. Queen Lex, I think it was you that recognized or said, you all said it basically that knows. So my channel is going to be like this sometimes, you know, where I just get on, feel the spirit, and go. And go. So um, because this dress is so... Like fashion and clothes, they're not just uh, fashion and clothes. That's that's some sacredness right there. Look at that dress. Oh, y'all can't even see the dress, but y'all can tell this is a goddamn classy dress. Who, what, where? Don't worry. I'm going to start using Target right. Y'all should get in touch with Target and be like, she be wearing the hell out of your clothes. She make them clothes look better than they do on that dang rack. Give her something. <laughs> she selling your damn claim. Nobody was thinking about no who, what, where. Nobody even knew that name till Lisa Marie came and put y'all on the map. Just tell them, y'all. Tell them. Tell them. Yes. 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 That was me. Yes, Queen. I thought so. We want you to be at all times. You at all times, no matter what channel we're on. Yes. Thank you. Like, that was so powerful, Queen. That was so powerful. Like, that freed me. Like, that was like, she's right. Like, so what? Like, you right after a while, Queen Lex, right? It's like it's like borders to separate different countries in Africa is bullshit, right? After a while, it's like, she like, you right. It's just you. So if you we tune in over there and we tune in over there, it's going to be you. And like I said, like this, look at the green. Like, look at the yellow. Like, the colors, like, you picking your house. It's for you. Like, wow. Like, it's to help you. It's as effective as taking the dandelion root. It's, it's, it accompanies, it, it affects you in the same way. It's the energy. It's lifting parts of your body. So if you got to eat more greens, then you need to be next to around or wear more greens. But you also are the daughter of Oshun, or you might be the daughter of Yamanya, or whoever that is. So you're going to be attracted... Or they come in through that way. That color was Oshun saying, I'm with you. It's like Sacred Woman got it. You purposely go into each gateway in Sacred Woman, the book Sacred Woman by Queen of Fua, to be with a certain goddess for a certain amount of time. That's how it works. But it's the same thing, whether you think you're picking up the book or not, 
I just got this. Like Oshun is coming. Like I'm the oh, I'm the goddess that is working with you right now. I go into Target and find this beautiful yellow dress. I want a jumpsuit and it's there. I want a beautiful blouse. I'll wear it tomorrow. And the same way I described it, the picture is there. The wall, the and then we do the pajama party and we call up Oshun. Yeah. I'm telling you, so goddesses come to gods and goddesses. The, the herbs that came, the herbs come from the goddess. The goddess brings the herbs. You're like, here's the herbs. This is the realm we're in. This is what we're working with. This is what the next step. I, I You're working with me. If you want to know, you're working with Oshun, just let them know. It's okay. You can tell them. I bring the hairstyle, the Oshun hairstyle. Bees are Oshun. She likes bangles and things that make noise. That's the cool one. Every time I put this in, I light up when my hair's in the Oshun style because Shalisha got it like that. The weave apparently was, it wasn't Oshun style. It wasn't Oshun style, you know? So, yeah, it's, um, it's, uh, she comes in and she's, remember, she's so beautiful. She's so into beauty. I don't know what this, this got to be her and the, and it was that day, I'm telling you, I'm sensitive. That thing that you put on the bottom of your dang feet, y'all don't get to say dang, but you put on the bottom of your feet? Mm. That thing, and then I'm gonna take these herbs? Y'all, y'all. Okay, let me get busy with these herbs, because I'm talking, and I know I take my herbs, and I got my other herbs too, and I like more uh, alfalfa. I have that only one, that's the only one I have, and I have dandelion as well, but I have the leaf, and he gave me the dandelion root. That root is the one. I, I'm smart enough to know that root. And there's yellow dock in there, too. There's the yellow dock one, too. I forgot. Yes, yellow dock. So I got to remember the yellow dock. So these are just all blood cleansers and powerful. And then I got the chlorella. Like I was telling you, I'm gonna, and I was saying I'm putting my water tomorrow. So that's how I flow. I ain't even seeing it. I think it's what it is. I already know what it was. And what it was, was I was supposed to get these herbs and vibe on this high level. And we were supposed to exchange that. And we'll see what else goes. You know, it's, it's hey, I'm, I love it all. It's, it's a very, it's a wonderful life. All right, queens. I love y'all with all my heart. Thank you for allowing me to be up here for an hour because I need this. Like, this helps me too. Exactly, says Queen Lex, right? Com comely, comely, oh, or I says, Okay. Okay. Thank you. Check out. It's the, it's the sun pack ring light. It will enhance your light. I appreciate that sun pack. I, you, I really appreciate that. Thank you. Muchas gracias. Lisa Marie, if you ever see a sunshine yellow jumpsuit at Target, please let me know. I'm a jumpsuit. You a jumpsuit hunter? Girl, them jumpsuits. Them jumpsuits. Either you a jumpsuit girl, you not. Like I tell you, my sister, my daughter was like, I don't want nothing to do with them damn things. They cute, but they too much to go through. I'll be ready and wanting to go through it. Like I'll be like, well, you know what? If I have to go through it, I will because I love a jumpsuit. I think it's a very chic look for women our age, Sheila, in our age group. In your 50s or whatever, beyond. I think that's a very chic look. It's very respectable, but it's still very classy and it's still very sexy or, or sensual or you know what I'm saying like it got all of the it got all of the components to make a girl feel good so I yes Donna I will let you know you always put me on I'm gonna put you on too and now that we can manifest that I think we just did so I we just manifested that so when I see it I know it's yours I'll let you know I because I, I know when we talk on things you know we man we just manifested that girl Yes, honey. Jumpsuits and bright. I was like, oh, Target. Honey, I walked in. Like, I'll go. There's a, a one uh, other designer. It's called Wild F Fable. And I like this stuff. It's very casual, but it's nice. And then you walk down to the other end of the Target and the clothes section. And then there's who, what, where. And then and nothing else. Everything else compares. I mean, pales in comparison. It's just like, damn, who, what, where. It's just got something there. It's like they think of a classy, oh, I bought this other dope, like, sweatshirt dress. This is like some weeks ago. Maybe like, yeah, it was, maybe it was a month, but it was a week. I didn't get to see this dress because I wore it and I couldn't remember where I put it. I need a closet space. We got to build me a nice little closet situation because I can't find my clothes. But I, I'm going to wear I can't wear that tomorrow. I can't wear everything tomorrow. I might wear it. I'll wear it this week so y'all can see it. Very classy, very... Very who, I think, no, you know what? I don't know if that was who, what, where. 
I think there's another one called Prologue, but I don't think I, I don't think I'm Prologue type. We'll see. Anyway, we can talk about the designers, you know. But uh, me and Target should be working together. I don't. I I just totally see this. Uh, let's go to straight to who, what, where because like, I seriously like their clothes. I'm not even playing. I ain't even playing. Yes, that's right. That's right. Come on. That's right. Queen Queen Lex says, I'm doing jumpsuits all 2020. Yes, Queen. Queen says, going to the bathroom is a little bit. I know, but it's worth it. That bathroom hassle ain't no. Trusty for us that drink a lot of water, we'd be like, what was I thinking? Yes, most young females won't wear them. Walk into a room wearing one and men will lose their mind. Yes, the men. And they don't even know that, honey. You don't gave away the secret. The secret is to deserve. Men love them jumpsuits. Love it. They get it. They get it. Yes. Did you show your dress? Did I miss it? No, let me show my dress. Queen Lex says, hey, when I have to use the restroom. I know. That's the thing, especially on the days when you are, like, drinking lots of water, y'all. That's when you really be like, damn, did I just drink all this water right now? Okay, I got to get a good look, and I don't know about the lighting, but we're going to do our best for y'all to get the idea. And I don't, mm -mm. I can go over here. See, you can't, well, I guess you can kind of see it, but this is it. Look at the sleeves. Ooh, the sleeves. And it's this, 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 this dope, like, can't explain the materials, this dope material. It's super dope. It's super dope. It's super beautiful. And I don't know. I know y'all couldn't really see my whole show. So we got to, that's why we got to get the studio going. The studio has to go so I could just, Show y'all everything, and we do it well. Yes, thank you, thank you. Now I'm trying to get y'all back, and I think, okay. Uh, very, yes, it's so beautiful, I love it. I love it so much. Yes, dress is a classic look. Yes, a very classic look, beautiful. So, like I said, if I had not wore this today, I would have worn this to the Saturday talk, but, you know, something else will catch my eye, or I probably have the right thing already. And it's all good. So, but Oshun has me, and I know the elements of golds and yellows is gonna definitely be fit. I'm gonna have to fit it into my life because she got me. All right. I love you. Have a beautiful, blessed day, ladies. And I will see you all in the next video. Peace and blessings.